Because my six month protective style challenge is over, my hair has grown a lot, and my hair is healthy. So you know why not? I really wanted to do this for the longest, and we're just gonna be down it with clear y'all textures and tones, blazing burgundy. And so I read the directions, so we just gonna go ahead and start this. Um, I got my hair into two sections. And it's already got some like product in it, so it's not dry. And we're gonna be putting this dye into the color activating cream. Oh shit. Okay. That does not look right. Do you put it all in? I guess so. I thought it wasn't gonna be enough for my whole head. But it definitely looks like you know. Okay, and my cameraman said I'm gonna have, said I'm gonna have to cut the top off. So uh yeah, I'm gonna cut that part. I'll be back, y'all. You can stop. <clears throat> Okay, so I put the dye in and I shook it up and I cut the top off. So now I'm just gonna be dyeing my hair. <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. It's, I'm nervous. So I'm gonna split my hair again into some more sections just so I can evenly distribute it. Thank you. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. Okay. We're so gonna start off right here. And so most people videos I saw and I noticed that your roots, you know, they process faster than your ends. So I'm gonna start off with my ends first and then go back around with the roots. I'm really doing this. What the freak am I doing? Oh my gosh, this really does smell like bleach. So, I'm currently dying the rest of my head, and I'm, I'm just doing the root, I'm just doing the ends so the, the roots don't process as fast. And I got a lot of dye left, so once I just let this sit, then I go in for my roots. But it's going pretty good. The color looks, it's, it looks dark because I haven't bleached my hair, but it looks pretty good. Okay, so now I'm just currently letting it process so it'll just, you know, hopefully get brighter. I'm gonna do it for I guess like 10 15 minutes so yeah even though <laughs> even though I've been trying to put it on for like the last I guess 15 minutes but hey another 15 won't hurt hopefully <laughs> if I mess this up I don't <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do y'all see y'all see how it's it, it, it stained that yeah I've sustained the door but we kind of got that off I don't know if you see that <laughs> dying home and hair I mean <laughs> dying here at home Mm -hmm, but I suggest it. 
um, you might need to lay everything out with like paper towels and and all type of all type of stuff because is it gonna stain everything? I'm not even done, and it's, and it's already red dye. Oh, and it's on here too. Okay, shoot. Okay, uh, yikes. Okay, so it's been about um, I would say ten minutes. And it definitely, definitely looks lighter. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start on the roots. You see like the color changing. So I'm trying to see if I'm just imagining this. And I'm trying to get all my hair so it just won't be like splotchy. You know, dye one place and then dye another place. I'm trying to get my everything. So that's why I'm just combing it through with my fingers. What? I like how you using that foul language in my video. Just foul. <laughs> you the cameraman. They can hear everything. Okay, there we go. I can see it now. Okay, my scab right now. 
Okay, you can start recording. Okay, so this is just what my hair looks like after I'm all done. And now I'm just gonna wash it out in the back of. Hey guys, this is just what my hair looks like. The finish result. It kind of scared me because it was like so dry when I was washing it out. I was like, oh my god, my hair gonna fall out. It's gonna break off being dry. But then I put in their intensive moisturizing and conditioner that came in the box. And my hair goes so soft. I'm gonna put some more in just so it can you know, stay moisturized. I definitely need to do go moisturize, moisture overload because baby. No, my hair's not falling now for a second time in years. I just, I said a second time. When I was transitioning, I had the wonderful idea of dying, well, getting my hair dyed in a salon. It was honey bun. Yeah, my ends just broke off. And uh, my hair will not fall out again. No, it won't. As for my curls, they are definitely popping. Like, the color makes them pop my texture did not change it is still the same as always still as bouncy as always and it goes right back when you spray it out it goes it just snaps right back yes look at that bounce Ooh. i'm surprised that it went all the way up to this color without me having to put bleach developer all that which I really think it was bleach in a box because they even though it said no ammonia it's probably most definitely bleach in there but not just not just as much bleach as you know as many chemicals as it would be with ammonia and all that but yeah it's just what it looks like I'm going to show you in the mirror and outside as well even though it's dark outside but you know hey you'll see and this is what it looks like in the in the mirror some of my roots aren't dyed all the way i don't know why but whatever these are dyed actually so okay. but it was my first time dying my hair i think i did pretty good what you think babe did i do good okay look enthusiasm oh fine stop caressing me ready 